knee, but right. uh, I'm still for young. For the knee, interesting, for the knee, but only for the knee, not under, not any other joint, although it might work for another joint, there is an injectable lubricant that the FDA approved as a liquid device. I love that, a liquid device. <laughs> <laughs> That's brilliant. I'm Lubricants that. and liquid Genius. devices. I don't know where this conversation is going, I Dr. Jeffy. Liquid Goodness. Device. So between you and me, it's like WD-40. So if you have a knee that's missing cartilage, not bone on bone disease. This is a lubricant. I inject it in the knee once a week. It and very fascinating. It comes from the jelly of the comb of a rooster. So the jelly of the comb, imagine, right? Exactly. The I'm, jelly I'm, of the comb of a rooster. Okay. The, the I'm, jelly I'm, of the comb of a rooster. Okay. The, the I'm, jelly I'm, of the comb I'm, of a rooster. Okay. The, Okay. Right. Continue, please. I'm a right. little. I'm, they, I'm trying to they, process this now. Exactly. <laughs> like, who was smart enough to think of that? Like, <laughs> just put, put your hands around that for a moment. Okay, fair enough. So that liquid, that jelly in there, is called hyaluron HYA, hyaluronic acid, and that seems to be the natural lubricants we all have in joints. So you might have like just a drop of it in your knee, just to keep things moist. So it turns out, if you have osteoarthritis of the knee. You can inject the knee with this stuff once a week for three weeks in a row. That's the process. And if it does work, the patients are comfortable for like six to eight months, and then you can get it again. Very interesting. Yeah. Did not expect to hear that today. And any